Hello everybody, this is part 3 of Until Goddamn Bloody Shit Ditty Dawn. Today we are playing episode no, part 3. Oh and uh. Black Ops 3, bitch! Fuck Black Ops 3, this is the shit! What the f. 360 no scope! Mesh dicks. Oh fuck, don't do that shit. Oh my god. Cringe. Goddamn cringe. Don't do that shit again, Josh. I will smack the shit out of your ass. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Uh No squirrel! Oh fuck. Um Must no 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 sound like fucking squirrels. I'm being smart. We're not shooting the squirrel because Sam loves squirrels. I know people want me to shoot the squirrel, but listen, man. I'm not ruining my game future. Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Ah, oh, this sucks. Uh, I want to practice more shooting. Black Ops 3 in this bitch better than all this Black Ops 3 cop. Let's look. Milgram Victor. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got hurt, all came running back. Here goes fast. Uh, yep. Here goes fucking fast. Like Sonic. You gotta go fast. Yeah. Josh wanted us to keep it locked, keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. Creepy. <laughs> That's fucking creepy. Like, who the fuck would sleep in a mountain, like, dangerous place where so two people are killed but they're still on the mountain? I think so, theory. Like, seriously, who the fuck would sleep in a gun down the station? Well, Ali, but they're poor. I know, but um, you don't really know that because it might have been just some peep creepy people. What a crazy you place know. to set up house. No matter how rich you are. Hotel soon. Okay, I gotta agree with um, goddamn uh, Chris because this is fucking creepy. Oh my god. Dude, I fucking, um, just a little warning, I'm sorry if that flashed your images out. Alright, if you got some problems with your eyes, I'm really sorry. Okay, we're gonna look one more time, if you got problems with your eyes, please look away. Three, two, one, go. Now, what it basically is, if you're covering your eyes, basically, it's like pictures of, um, the, um, house. I mean, like, oh my god, my eyes. Oh, fuck, you can look away now. Well, you can open your eyes now, fuck. <laughs> Sorry guys, I need to stop talking fast. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. yeah, mean you mean let the Z's out, not catch. But anyway, one mistake, I've had plenty. Okay, let's enter the car. Just like going to the prom. How? You don't go to proms in these kind of shit vehicles. Are you mad? Yeah. Adventure begins. Oh, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him. I kind of be worried. No, no, it was it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Bro, good talk. You know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? How? Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front where I was sitting. Mm hmm. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? 
and next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, the fuck? Friends to this day. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Gene Simmons hit you really like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off the train rock, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Yep. Oh, butterfly effect. Yay, he mentioned the butterfly effect. Like we've already, you know what, fuck yeah, I'm too busy. Dude, can I just say something? The cover of this fucking game shows a skull and a timer. The fuck has to, does that have to do with the game? Oh, who's this bitch? Jess, Mike's new girlfriend. Confident, trusting, irrelevant. <laughs> She's irrelevant? How the fuck is she? Irrelevant, irrelevant. How the fuck is she? She's confident, she's trusting, and she's irrelevant. How the fuck? <laughs> Jess is Mike's new girlfriend. Also, the um, Emma is like, oh my, can I just say something? The fuck is up with that smile? God damn. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Would you walk someone that smile on me and like, the ass and shit? That's great. What the fucking smile? What the fuck? Okay, let's go. Oh, look at this. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. You know what to do with that big fat butt. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, let's go. What the? What the f Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Okay, we are trustworthy. So yeah. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh sick, Chris. Look, mm. got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have? Chris. Here? My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. What the fuck? What kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Uh. You know what? Fuck it. Give me the phone back, man. Not your business. Two and die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Give him the phone back, man. Go nosing around in other people's. Nostrils. Sorry, okay, guys. You know when you're the other character, you might think it's funny, but when the when the character you you when you play it as picks on like pisses off your character you're playing as now, it fucking pisses you off. Like I hope they don't do this for the rest of the game. Even even Emma agrees. Like she's like, yeah, this fucking works. Yeah, this sucks. So yeah, I like Chris, but now I'm pissed off with him. As from a person, as plain as another person, he's an asshole now. Whatever, you'll figure it out eventually. All right, all right, let's just get. Some of them, Jess. Some of them, Jessie's like a bitch, but I don't think she's a bitch. I think she's alright. There's a problem. Is like she's just like I don't know, pissed off sometimes. But sometimes when she's pissed off, I can I can relate to that shit because I get annoyed some pretty much. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh -huh. Sam? Do you think this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Okay, uh, Emily, Mike's ex, intelligent, resource, persuasive. If she was persuasive, oh, like, I don't know, she's intelligent, resourceful, and she's persuasive. I don't like persuasive bastards. Here's I'm the thing. Been like as pretty. Can I just tell you something? You know how, like, um, it says, oh, this character is this and that. Sometimes the choices make the character an even asshole. Like, how, if you want to explain how the personality is, what the fuck you gonna make them have bad choice? Make the you know what? I see, I see now. I'm just being stupid, you know what? Just continue the game. 
Matt, name his new motivation. Motivation, ambitious, and active. Active! Oh my god, I think there's gonna be a little. Ooh, you touch my child, I lost scenes. I'm just kidding. What the fuck could he mean by active? I raised my eyebrow. Who knows? I'm putting my teeth on my um, lower lip and raising my eyebrows. Mm. Something's about to go down in this game. Emily and Matt sitting in the bed. Yeah, you know, you know the rest. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Hey, shut up, man. I'm not. I'm no bellboy. Well, I got a big bell. And I'm a boy, but you said it wrong. Getting chilled. We're almost there. No, I mean getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, me You're too. I. Yep. Yeah. What do you think? Ah! What the fuck? Jesus! Dude. You <laughs> asshole! Dude, Mike, Emily's ex. Intelligent, driven, and persuasive. Oh, fuck, I hate persuasive people. <laughs> they piss you off by asking questions, pissing you, you off by really saying you do this. Right Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> you should have! Michael, you're a jerk. Cool. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Dude, not like we're that, man. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. Shut up. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? Like, why? M, calm down. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Oh. Uh. Um. Well, you are kind, but. Mike, that was very naughty. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. Oh, fuck me. I'm not gonna tell you again. Wrong choice. We each other? Well, I thought maybe we could move past all this. Be buds. But, yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. No, it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road. Be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. Kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? Oh, crap. Oh my god. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Um, why? Oh, this is where persuasion kicks in. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Okay, I'll let you go. Wait, no, I'm not leaving you alone. You're my girl. Um, I really don't You're my think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? Oh my god. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help Period, bitch mode. I'm really sorry, okay? women of my my fans of women. Uh, Period, bitch mode. Period, bitch mode. Period, bitch mode. Period, bitch mode. Sorry, guys. Okay, who is this? Huh? Ashley has a crush, of course. Oh, so this is um, Chris's uh, thing. Like, girlfriend. He has a, well, he has a crush on that. Academic. Inquisitive and thoughtful. Okay. Um, two of those words I don't know, but thoughtful. Okay. Or Facebook. Oh, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. I'm not in the friend zone kind of way. I might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Hey, whoa. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you. You sort of asshole. Scary, you fucking did. Oh, oh my god. god. Hey, Why? Sorry, Ash, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Why? Why? Uh, you 